on that and it's time. I gotta tell my mom. Don't leave, no, mom. What are you going, this. mom? Oh, mom. No. Come here. No. Mom, come here. I won't feel you. Oh, guys, I literally got boxes, y'all. The room looked crazy, but we got the boxes. Ah, oh, Nat, it's time. I gotta tell my mom. Maybe it's not gonna be as bad. Maybe not, I don't know. How do you think she's gonna react? I honestly think she's gonna get emotional. Like, you're her baby. I she know. says she really wishes that her kids could live with her forever. Forever. So, Which is understandable as a mom. Understandable. I don't want my kids to move. Yeah, them little you nappy little niggas gonna have to move out of 18. No, they not. <laughs> oh, all right, y'all. I'm about to go tell my mom. Um, I'm nervous a little bit because I'm excited, but I'm nervous to tell her. You know, I'm so. gonna be sad. I'm going to just tell the whole house at the same time. All right, let's go. <sighs> okay, let's go, guys. All right, guys. Family meeting. Where the camera came out? Frank, I don't know, man. You've been pushing my buttons a lot lately, but you know, <laughs> I'm gonna let you slide. My bro's over there, you know. How's it going, bro? He's like, get me off the camera. Now you still haven't get you guys still haven't got her Christmas gift? That was the first time I ever said that. You be calling her the B word. You I mad know. about it, bro? That's, different. That's, That's that not different. All the time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's hurry up. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Hell no. That's, I don't even know. <laughs> but it's like not like that. Be like. So Dorno actually had to go to a meeting. You know, with his uh, his dad and his brother. Um, you know, I wanted to gather you guys all here today. Oh, you're not gonna tell him. Dorno. Yeah, I tell Dorno. Um, he just you know, let him have, be in that meeting. You know, his brother and his dad. You know, his sister doesn't matter. <laughs> well, make sure you specify yeah. that this was last minute. Yeah. He had I'm, that already. I'm obviously joking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But so she wanted to make sure that, you know. Yeah, yeah. because you know the trolls. Exactly. But, <laughs> I'd be like, Darno doesn't give a shit. Yeah, Darno doesn't know what's going on. So I'm not tripping at all. Um, Yeah, so I wanted to have you guys here today. To tell you guys, it is that time. I knew it. I'm, I, I'm, I'm leaving. Don't leave, no, mom. What are you going, just, mom? No, I didn't even say what happened. No, I already know. Uh, well, you know, Frank. Um, you know, I'm, I got approved for a house, so you know, I wanted to tell you guys. Definitely wanted to talk to you guys, but I got approved, and it went good. And Natalie and I are moving in together. Thanks, Frank. Thanks, Frank. I'm the only one here. My mom walked out. She doesn't want to talk. I know, mom. Oh, mom. No. Come here. No. Mom, come here. I won't film you. Come here. Don't cry. Don't cry, mom. I know. I know. You are gonna see me, mom. I'm gonna see you now. I see you. I'm gonna see. No, I don't. Don't cry, mom. Let me put the camera down. So let me know if you want me to stop recording. I can. This is okay. tough. I mean, I know. I already knew because I, I was saying, I was just telling Frank, my mom, like, this is all she told me to do when I was leaving. And I was even going across the country. <laughs> yeah, as soon as I, I caught a bus out here. Yeah, yeah, your little girl's growing up, mom. I know. You know, it's just getting to that age. I feel like this house literally is our home. You know, this is the I feel like we stayed in this house the longest out of every house we've had, and you know, it's so many memories. I grew up here, right here. I was doing freaking magic shows. You know what I'm saying? In high school, and it's just like. You know, I'm gonna miss it, you know, and I just feel like as a mature adult, as a mature woman, I feel like it's finally time. You know, I stayed as long as I could and you know, I, I felt like, you know, I've been ready to move out, but I didn't want to, you know, that, that nostalgic feeling of being home and just being close to my family, you know. I know I'm always working, but it's just like, yo, like I like living here, it's just cool, you know, but 
as my business excels and you know my relationship gets stronger it's just like you know it's time for us to get our house you know she's outgrown her one bedroom apartment and i've outgrown my two bedroom apartment house back house and i'm finally ready to spread my wings mom no well i'm proud of you and i'm happy for you even though i'm sad mm -hmm. I mean, it's not because I don't want you to move on or I don't want you to excel or experience life, you know, and pay bills on time and yes. shit like that, <laughs> that you need to, you need that. I know you need it, mm -hmm. but that doesn't make it any easier yeah. because you're my baby. Yeah. Yeah. And I like having, I mean, even though I'm always complaining about my kids because mm -hmm. they're here, I like having you here. And I want it, I mean, even as selfish as it may sound i want to just be together forever oh stop you made me cry oh that's a good mom right there yeah this is a mother's you know, love i grew up here and you know i just feel like i've gained so much in this house and just being around you becoming a woman and you helped me learn how to be an adult you know what i'm saying when it comes to all right, I gotta pay bills, I gotta do this. I feel like if I would just moved out when I could, I would probably be an, irres be an irresponsible person. You know what I'm saying? But thankfully, you're on top of me when it comes to being an adult and stuff like that. So I just, you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't be where I'm at right now. If it wasn't for you, you know what I'm saying? And I appreciate you, I love you, and I love Frank, you know, he's a good man for you. You know what I'm saying? And it's just, you know, I, I, I dreaded this with a passion. Mm -hmm. um, we just found out literally today. We just found out today, and literally, you know, everything's good. Um, you know, it's it's gonna be hard, but to so where do you move in? Literally, they said we could move in till tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, if we want. You know, the house has literally been on the market for quite some time, and out of all the candidates, they're like, we love you guys. You know, and you guys can have the key tomorrow. You know, we're like, whoa. Like, you know, usually they need time. Man, what's going on? Okay. I'm gonna move out, bro. To where? A new house. <laughs> where? Where? On the bright side, you know, you two can have another baby. Or your first. Uh, she's like, I uh, you don't smoke. Yeah. Yeah. What does that have to do with kids? <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, good. Okay. Not when they, not when they travel. Oh shit, Frank, like, hell no. I'm waiting for y'all little niggas to get out. Not when they travel, diapers, whatever. Oh, they can. Right. Yeah. You guys are more than welcome to come home. I can't wait for you guys to see. How many rooms? <sighs> That's up to you. Okay, out. Okay.